Welcome back to Underwater Math. I'm Scout, and today we are learning to add and subtract whole numbers using the standard algorithm. My friend Luna has been training for a race. Her goal is to run 2,500 minutes in the first three months. She ran 1,700 minutes in the first month, 350 minutes in the second month, and 200 minutes in the third month. How many more minutes does she need to run to meet her goal of 2,500 minutes? We need to know how many minutes Luna has run so far by adding the three numbers together. We will start from the ones place and work our way over. 0 plus 0 plus 0 equals 0. 0 plus 5 plus 0 equals 5. 7 plus 3 plus 2 equals 12. The 2 goes at the bottom and carry the 1 over to the next place value. 1 plus 1 equals 2. Luna has run 2,250 minutes so far. The question asked how many more minutes Luna needs to run to meet her goal. We can subtract the minutes she has run from her goal to find the remaining amount. Again, we start in the ones place. 0 minus 0 equals 0. Next is the tens place. We cannot subtract 5 from 0, so we need to borrow from the next place value. The 5 becomes a 4, and our 0 becomes a 10. Now we can subtract. 10 minus 5 equals 5. In the next place value, we have 4 minus 2, which is 2. Finally, 2 minus 2 is 0. Luna needs to run another 250 minutes to reach her goal. Let's try another one. My owners have been working on gardening. They planted a bunch of flower seeds, and their flowers started growing. In April, 456 flowers grew. In May, 394 flowers grew, and I picked 83 for my mom. In June, 198 flowers grew, and I picked 214 for my dog house. How many flowers were in our garden at the end of June? Let's see. In April, 456 flowers grew, and another 394 in May. I am going to add these together to see how many flowers we had. 6 plus 4 equals 10, carry the 1. 5 plus 9 plus 1 equals 15. The 5 goes at the bottom, and we carry the 1. 4 plus 3 plus 1 equals 8. We had 850 flowers in May. Then, I picked 83. Let's subtract 83 from 850 to see how many flowers we had left in May. We can't subtract 3 from 0, so we have to borrow from the 5. The 5 becomes a 4 and our 0 becomes a 10. 10 minus 3 is 7. Again, we can't subtract 8 from 4, so we need to borrow from the 8, and the 4 becomes a 14. 14 minus 8 is 6. Finally, 7 minus 0 is 7. We had 767 flowers left in May. 198 more flowers grew in June. We can add 198 to our 767 flowers we had left. 7 plus 8 is 15, carry the 1. 6 plus 9 plus 1 is 16, carry the 1. 7 plus 1 plus 1 equals 9. We had 965 flowers. I picked 214 of those flowers, which we subtract from 965 to find how many flowers we had left. 5 minus 4 is 1, 6 minus 1 is 5, and 9 minus 2 is 7. There were 751 flowers left in the garden. Are you ready to practice? Give it a try and have fun.